everybody and welcome back to another episode of my sims and bloom series thank you so much for your lovely comments on the first episode i'm glad most of you guys like flora and where her story is heading at the moment she is getting a little bit of a sleep in this morning with juan i'm actually surprised that they both ended up asleep in the bed considering last episode we did see that he basically did not get to sleep at all so i'm really surprised they both made it to bed but she actually has a full bar of energy at the moment so i am going to get her up for the day help get her in the shower and she does have her first gig today as well Alrighty, come on stinker time to get into the shower um she did everything she needs to do for her gig today i'm pretty sure yeah acting and charisma so she's all good to go basically the only thing we need to do is have a shower and probably get a little bit of food even though actually she's all right and then she'll be heading in today for her first ever gig i'm assuming she's probably a little bit nervous since this is her first gig in her new career oh work starts in an hour but so far she seems fine she's not really nervous at all she's feeling happy from having cuddles this morning Oh, she's a little bit tense from a social bunny post, but aside from that, she's feeling pretty good. And honestly, all of her needs are perfect. Like, I can't complain at all. They're all great. <laughs> Carol's off at school today. I'm actually going to get her to make some friends today, and I'm going to get Flora to come in and just check in on her kids. They're both asleep in the room this morning, so we'll come in, and oh, they're both actually asleep, so I'm not going to wake them up. I think I'm just gonna come and watch Lotus while he sleeps then. Okay, she's just watching them. She's like, cool, nothing I need to do in here. They're asleep. <laughs> um, and everyone else is out here. Ooh, someone made brownies. Oh my gosh, Joy made brownies. Oh, we probably won't come and get one though because we're just about to go into work in a couple minutes. I'm gonna join her today and yeah, let's head in. I'm pretty excited to be honest. Okay, so here we are. We have a couple things we need to do. This is actually the producer. So we have to get into hair, makeup, practice acting, update social media status. Okay, she's off to the toilet. Why? She wants to clean it? No, like <laughs> she is a clean freak or she has like the neat trait. So I can understand why she would want to clean it, but you are not part of the cleaning crew, Miss Thing. You are actually an actress here. And the first thing I want to do is go ahead and update our social media status. And then we have to get you into hair and makeup. Oh my gosh, the whole crew is here. <gasps> it's been so long since I've done this career. I completely like forgot how to do it actually. <laughs> okay, where is hair and makeup? Okay, over here then. I'm just going to pop the walls down. Let's get into hair and makeup for our gig. Um, we're just having something quickly to eat because we do have to eat some food. And I want to try and meet some of our co-workers and everything. Special effects operator, producer, 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 <laughs> producer, and producer. Okay, there's five producers. For an AI agency, they actually have a lot of real people here. All right, here we go. It's hair and makeup time. I'm kind of nervous her hair color is going to change. Oh my god gosh what have we done this is not right is it <laughs> okay, let's try that again i am so nervous right now do not ruin my lovely girl's hair please <laughs> she's gonna be a famous celebrity it'll be embarrassing if you make her look awful oh my god really oh that's awful she literally didn't do anything okay get into the costume i guess we don't have to wear any particular kind of hairstyle for work then that's exciting we're a pirate okay don't mind her hair and then we have to practice some acting real quick okay so we practice acting so now we need to go tell the director that we're ready um where is the director oh it's obviously this lady in the chair <laughs> okay so we'll come in just do a nice polite introduction get to know her we actually got a message from our Agent say, saying hello there. That's interesting. Here we go. We'll come over and we'll say hi and then tell her we're ready to go. Hello. Nice to meet you. I'm Flora. I am going to be on set today. Okay. Um, that's nice. A hug. Okay. Tell director we're ready to perform. Okay. So we're all good to go if you are. Wonderful. Okay. 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 So now we have to perform over here. So let's come and do, I'm going to do a risky show product because we did practice our charisma skill, so we're going to do it. Look at her walking all sassily up to the stage. <laughs> this is exciting. Okay, are you ready, Flora? To give the show of your life? Okay. Do you guys buy this laundry detergent? 
<laughs> Whoa, look at it. Yeah, get it, Flora. <laughs> and cut. Okay, perfect. And then let's do a risky turn wheel as well. Hopefully this goes to plan. She definitely is a risk taker, this little lady. So I want to pick the risky options. I don't want to pick the safe ones. Okay. Really? What do they think of us? Mop the stage? Risky mop. <gasps> I'm nervous. <laughs> Breathe. You've got this. You've got this. Ooh, we caught it. That was impressive. Yay! Okay, we did everything we needed to do. Um, and we're golden. So do we, is there anything we need to do? I guess the only thing is that we can like become closer with some of these people. So I think I'm over and just talk about our dreams with our director, I guess, and just put in a good word for the next gig we go for. Maybe she'll personally ask for us, who knows? And I also want to meet some of these other staff as well. Okay, that's a wrap. Flora's finished all of her scenes. The crew is shutting down and the footage is being sent to editing. Nice. I'm going to stay on the lot. Okay, I'm going to say hi to all these people and get to know them. <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh, we're a noble. Oh my gosh, gosh. We got, we got a fame point, I think. We are a noble newcomer. So I'm going to check our fame points. We have one fame point which means we can get one of these things. So I'm going to get the, I think I'm going to get the noticeable one for now. So it basically says there's just something about Flora that makes her stand out from the crowd and makes other Sims take notice. By honing this aspect of her personality, there's a chance that any single skill or career-based action from here on out may catch the public's attention, giving Flora an extra boost of fame. Nice. Okay. We have a fame point. Nice to meet you. Okay. I really want to be friendly with everybody like in the beginning because she, she's, she's a very small celebrity, like one fame point. Like no one really knows her. She's performed in like what, one ad and it, it was a good hit. She did well. So, but yeah, she's, she hasn't starred in anything massive at this stage. Okay. We're just meeting everyone. This guy is very flirty and he's flirting with us. Just be careful because you don't want to get a bad reputation from flirting with other people <laughs> okay i'm gonna check if there's any other auditions open okay so we have some other things here which one goes for the most money this one here comedy level three tuesday 7 p.m is the audition can we get up to level three of comedy before then i don't know if we can i'm going to try it what currently is our comedy level at comedy is level one okay i guess we can start to be funny with some people then let's just um do an impression and see if we can get this comedy skill up i'm gonna tell a joke about penguins <laughs> she thinks we're very funny comedy level two. Oh my gosh okay we might get this up to level three in no time because it's going up super fast oh my gosh we're actually gonna get it up to level three like we're boosting it it's gone crazy we're just being silly with those people and it's going right up. Tell a funny story with everyone. Okay, I think we can do one more silly thing and we should be able to get it up to level three. Crazy. Also, she got a new quirk, no touching. Just because um, Flora is famous, everybody seems to think that Flora is all right with having her personal space invaded. Ooh, okay. And we also got a new personality insider, which I think is fitting. So I said yes to that one. Yay, comedy level three. And you know what? It's actually perfect because I did notice that the Humor and Hijinks Festival is on tonight, which I think we should travel to because then we can do some more like funny interactions with people. So I'm going to go to this tonight and I'm going to invite Juan. Um, I think we'll do like a bit of a date, honestly, and spend some time with him. And yeah, let's just, we can do some funny things. It'd be a good time. Okay, here we are. I'm just inviting Juan to see if he is available. Come, I'm also just going to change my outfit into something else. Is it cold tonight? Yeah, okay, we'll put our winter outfit on then. Oh my gosh, look at Trevor. He must have been at the, a gig as well. That's so funny. Yeah, I didn't end up seeing him there, which is crazy, but that's okay. And hey, okay, hey Juan, what's up? Do you want to come get a drink from the jokesters as well? We can be on the same team. All right, we're going to join the jokesters, I believe. And hey, Han, how are you doing? Spend some time with him. We'll do some funny interactions with him to see how he's doing. We're in a hysterical mood. I don't think I have um, 
emotional deaths enabled so I'm not too worried about that but I do want her to kind of calm down so um let's let's fish for some compliments from him we'll let him know how our gig went and we'll tell him like yeah I met so many famous people the producer loved me she said she wants to hire me again for something else like a bigger part not just like a commercial that's great right I'm doing so well for myself kiss in the snow wait that's what is that What just happened? Okay, so I'm restarting the night and um, for context, emotional deaths definitely are enabled, but that's okay. Here we are. Essentially, I had to replay through her day at work and it went exactly the same, but she does have different co-workers, so she met different people. <laughs> but that's okay. Anyway, back to what we were doing. So um, we were just hanging out with Juan and I want to make sure we're being like romantic with him and I'm gonna keep an eye on how playful she gets this time but we definitely want to spend some time with him and make sure he knows that he's appreciated because we haven't really been appreciating him that much recently I know he's stay-at-home dad but being stay-at-home dad definitely is still a lot of hard work and I don't know I'm just gonna meet some more people I guess around here okay you gotta go to the toilet go on he's gonna have his food and then Oh, there's like people doing things over here, like telling jokes and stuff. We should do that as well. Um, perform routine, practice singing, practice acting. There's a lot of things we can do out here, but no, we, we are on a date. So <laughs> a compliment for Florence is so very unexpected, but also totally required. Oh my gosh. I love how much he is just obsessed with her. Like she fishes for compliments and immediately he's like, oh, of course, of course, babe. You're the best. <laughs> well, we are very, very happy after our first gig today. So I can imagine that she's going to be extra flirty with him and going to be like smoochy and kissy and everything. Actually, are we the jokesters? I think we're in the lead at the moment. So we're doing pretty well. She's very playful. So I'm not going to get her to do any more like funny interactions. But yeah, she's all over him. We're actually a little bit hungry as well. So I'm going to come and order some food and um, we'll just get some pho and just have a good time. Probably won't stay out too long. We ended up getting our skill to level three for our gig tomorrow. So we'll all feel good in that department. She wants to ask him about his day, surprisingly. Okay. Oh, the fireworks are going off. Oh my gosh. So nice. This has been a good night. I think, I think he needed this, you know. He's been at home with the babies a lot and we've just been off focusing on what we want to focus on. So I think he really needed this to just feel very secure in their relationship currently, which I'm happy about. She took that off and now she wants to make a friend, a new friend, I'm guessing. Well, we'll try and make a celebrity friend. How about that? Okay, she's not really the best with chopsticks. <laughs> okay, guys, I think we should probably head on back home. It is pretty late at night. We do have a gig, not gig, but like an audition tomorrow. So I want to be able to practice for that before we go to that. All right, we're home. I want to check in on Kara before bed. Come see how she's doing. Give her a big hug. You're like, how's my little girl doing? Did you have a good day at school? I saw she met some friends today, so she's doing pretty well. I do want to encourage her to do her homework though, because she has not been doing it and she's doing very bad in school. So you need to do your homework. Um, I'll get Flora to actually help her out with it. Because when it comes to her little sister, she will do anything for her. <laughs> All right, you help her with this outside. And I think Juan's inside. Yep, he is feeding his babies. He's doing very well. And I'm going to see if he can quickly just sneak into the shower. Come take a brisk shower very quickly. Um, and how are my bubs doing? This one over here is a little bit hungry and also stinky. I might see if Joy is happy to help her out. Eric having a nice bottle from Grandma. <laughs> Crazy. Quan squeamish? No, I don't think he would be. He's doing good for himself. Don't worry. He's doing all right. I get him to come out and just do some quick like DJ mixing. Uh, we'll do some chill out music. Some music for when Flora comes in. Maybe she'll want to dance to it or something. But yeah, she's busy helping her sister with her homework. I know that the neighbors are going to absolutely hate us for playing music this time of night, but I don't care. They're kind of the worst anyways. <laughs> and our lives are a little bit backwards at the moment. We're always up super late at night and then we sleep in, so... Yeah, he's gonna practice some things he wants to do. He's had a good night, he's gone on a date. Flora's mums are helping with the babies. And yeah, he's kind of just 
vibing at the moment. I feel like he's having a good time. I'm gonna get Flora to actually come over and dance to what he is doing when she finishes over here. Okay, I think that she can finish off the rest by herself, but yeah, you've helped her with majority, which is a good system move. Okay, she's come in and yeah, we're just gonna dance to Hong's music. Nice. <laughs> She's like, wow, babe, I didn't realize you were so good at this. Why don't you take this up as like a day job? But he can't, obviously, because, well, day job is being stay-at-home dad. Yeah, she's loving it. She's loving it. Let's watch him a little bit. Let's stop dancing. All right, she's watching him and he's like, hey, did you want to have a go? So I think Flora is actually going to come over and let's practice. We're probably nowhere near as good as Juan is, but we'll have a go at it. Okay, here Flora goes. Nice. Good job. She's got that DJ moves on. Juan ended up going to bed, but I'm gonna actually have him come over and watch her. Wow, okay. I feel like she's discovering that she actually is enjoying this and maybe this is something her and Juan could do together. He could like teach her how to get better. Yeah, I feel like he's totally vibing. Good job, Flora, although you're super tired. Okay, Juan, I think we need to pop this baby to bed. <laughs> although we got a diaper change first, classic. And then buddy can go to bed, okay. Two sleepy heads have had a big night. A nice night together though. A really nice night and they've really enjoyed it. So now they're gonna head to bed. Lotus is sad, but honestly he can just sleep, okay? So can you let's go try your night night buddy, okay? It'll be all good. It's actually the twins' birthdays today, so I think while these guys sleep, I might get Joy and Poppy to kind of organize a bit of a party. And while they're organizing a bit of a party, I think they're also going to start preparing for their wedding because <laughs> I really want them to get married. So I think we'll do a wedding in one of the next upcoming episodes. Um, I also want these guys to eventually move out. So I think it's it's only right that we do a wedding. So I guess I guess Joy is just browsing the computer now, looking at different things, pay our bills while we're here. Okay, so it's all booked in for Saturday and they're finally going to get married, which is really exciting. So it probably will happen in the next episode. <laughs> Aw, these two are so cute snuggling. Okay, so it's the twins' birthday today and I don't even know what I want to do for their birthday party. I don't even know if we'll do anything too crazy. Maybe we'll like go out to the park and like bring some friends along and stuff. I don't really want to be trapped in the apartment for another day. Maybe we'll just do it like at the park or something. I'm going to do it for like maybe 1 p.m. today. And Poppy, I think, can go ahead and get some cakes sorted for their birthday then. We should have a cake box. Do you have that still in your inventory? Maybe not. I think we're actually going to have to cook. <laughs> no! <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what happened to the cake box. It's gone. Okay. Okay, cake is made. Well done. I'm surprised it's not poor quality. He's actually done well. Let's pop some candles on this birthday cake. And it is Winterfest tomorrow. What is going on? Who's calling us? During free time, Carol drew an inappropriate... Okay, um, we encourage creativity. Carol can draw whatever she wants. Okay. That can go in our inventory. If you're hungry, grab some of these. Don't eat the cake. And then let's just clean up the house a little bit since we've got some time to kill. She also has a video like vlog that she needs to do. So I'm going to get her to come over and record a video. Do a love advice vlog. That sounds fun. Flora is surprisingly up. What are you doing up, Queen? Do you want to get yourself some food then if you're awake? <laughs> I guess she'll do that. I'll get some leftovers from the fridge. And I think Juan can get up as well. Big stretch. Okay, come give you a bottle. And how are you doing over here? He's good. He's hanging out with grandma. Nope. <laughs> is, she gonna, is he going to bite her? Almost. Are you able to do some play with toys over here, buddy? Okay, Lotus is having his little milk over here. Leaf is just chilling. Aw, they're honestly so sweet. I love my little boy so much. Look, he's so happy from watching his infant. They're doing really well with their milestones as well. They're doing really well. Okay, one more hour and then we have to head off to the party. <laughs> okay, birthday party's about to begin. Should we go? Yes, let's do it. Oh my gosh, here we are. <laughs> and the boys are dressed up as bunnies. That is so cute. Okay, everyone's in like their party clothes. I think Joy may have dressed up a little bit too much and same with Flora, but now I can see where she gets it from. And immediately she's handing the baby over to... um. So Juan, of course she is. Okay. Oh, she needs a toilet. Okay, look, fair enough, fair enough. Okay, so all of our like friends are here and everything. We have um, Raven, who is our sister. Definitely want to come and say hi to her. 
and um, we'll give her a big hug and then obviously Leah's come as well I want to like introduce her to the baby introduce to Lotus I think are you leaf yeah you're leaf birthday baby okay we have a couple things we need to do here comes like Rue and um oh my gosh Jordan <laughs> trying to remember everyone's names and I also invited the kids because it is kind of a kids party so I invited all of Raven's children as well yeah we're doing well and then who have we got over here okay Robin so we actually haven't seen Robin since she aged up into a teenager and as you guys probably can tell she has gone through her transition so she is now a woman she is a transgender woman and I think she's beautiful yeah I'm really happy for her um I think Flora and everyone's really happy for her as well I'm just glad that she she's happy with herself so we give her a hug and say hi we haven't actually seen her since she was a kid I think she's the oldest of the cousins yeah Flora is the second eldest so probably get along with her best out of everyone Rory's calling um is it because we didn't invite you well we may have actually don't know if we invited him all right Poppy has the birthday cake so I'm gonna come put it over on the table and I'm gonna go ahead and age up the sims but not quite yet everyone's just playing games I guess <laughs> I don't really know what to do here to be honest like it's a winter's day I like we'll just play in the snow um I guess I'll build a snow pal with raven and joy can come make a snow angel everyone's just catching up we're just having a good time i guess like it doesn't really need to be a party we're just hanging out and having a good time okay everyone's like gathering in the bathroom oh uh zara is actually here i think the funniest thing is is that we actually want to become enemies with zara we do not like kwan's mother at all oh someone pranked the toilet and now we're going to it wonderful yeah spilt it all over us okay Tell jokes, eat food, have Sims listen to the stereo at the same time. <sighs> okay, I guess we can do that. So I'll come tell some jokes in here then. Just tell a funny story. And I also want to tell a joke to Robin. Okay, that's how jokes done. And now we're waddling off to go see who else is around here. Are we going to go pick up our other child? I think so. Juan, why don't you grab him when you're back then? Put him in your back carrier. He's tired. He probably wants to sleep, okay? <laughs> I don't know about you, but this is kind of cute. Look, they both got the babies. <laughs> We're hungry. We need to make some food. Poppy, can you can you cook something, please? Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm gonna get her to just grill some chicken skewers then. And we really need to have these babies blow out their candles, but I actually can't get them to do it here. So I'm gonna go try it on this table. I feel like we had a birthday party here in the past and I had the same issue. I couldn't like figure out how. And then I was like, I had to do it in the bathroom or something, right? Laura has her audition in an hour. Crap, we really need to age up these kids then. I didn't realize her audition was in an hour. All right, let me get this cake. We're gathering over here. Okay, come over here together, guys. And let's go ahead and age up these babies then. Okay, I'm gonna age up little... Where are they both asleep? I don't think I can age up an infant with the cake here. Problem solved. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's have Lotus blow out these candles then. All right, guys, gather around. It is candle time for these boys. Are we ready? <gasps> Happy birthday, Lotus. There he goes, spitting all over the cake. Such a good job, buddy. <laughs> okay, so he's aged up as a charmer. You. There he is. He's got his little cape on. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh my god, Joy passing out. This is a hot mess. Flora's got to go. Flora has got to go. Flora, you have to go to your audition. It's now, right? Oh, you didn't get the role. What? Oh my gosh, she didn't even get it. Okay, don't worry, baby. Let's come and help black candles for um, Leaf as well. He's just sleeping on the floor. Okay, this is a hot mess. <laughs> this is a really bad birthday party. Hey, there we go. Happy birthday, Leaf. Oh, she's actually really happy for him. There we go. And he is wild. Great. There we go. There are my boys. Yay. Good job, you two. Toddlers. Good fun. Good fun. Okay, so it said her edition failed didn't get the role the casting director didn't say if it was because of your line reading or because of the fistfuls of mints you took from the check desk you better work on those just to be prepared for next time <gasps> once reason to death i don't know what's wrong with these guys okay anyway 
Okay, so she failed it. That's unfortunate. We even had the right, like, skill and everything. So I think we're going to have to get another gig then. It still says that we have a gig active. All right, we're all very, very cold. So I think what I'm going to do is just send everyone home before someone dies. Okay, my whole cold crew is back home now. I'm going to cancel, delete this audition and get another one because, yeah, it said we failed it for some reason. I don't know what's happened there. I think this is really just... How my day is ending honestly okay well i'm gonna go ahead and wrap things up here thank you guys so much for watching today's episode was a little bit chaotic but in the next one i'll make sure flora has a new audition and hopefully she'll be prepared for it. i don't know what happened with this one she literally was level like four of comedy by the time it came around so i don't know why she would have failed it but that's okay um you know sometimes we win sometimes we lose and she'll tr just keep trying again so it's all good but thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed today's episode don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe if you're not already and i'll see you guys in the next one bye